Hello everyone, welcome to Programming Knowledge. So this is the 33rd tutorial of our Django series. So I again welcome you all to Programming Knowledge. So basically in the today's tutorial, we are going to continue with our to-do app. So basically we will perform a search query based on title. So title of this uh, uh, video is search data. So basically what the data we have in the all to-do app. So basically I'll show my app. So we have add list all to-do and this is sort by priority. So basically in list all to-do section, we have all the to-dos. So basically I can add few more as well. So let me do, do some uh, like uh, I added on uh, uh, let me do Django. So I have it on Django and then Django priority. I'll give it to number one topmost priority. So here you can see I have on Django then or, or I'll do another one add another one Python and I'll add on Python again Python uh, I'll add priority again to number two okay or maybe one also so here i have added python also so basically if you want to search our, our to do's so we can form a search query so for that i'll refer to the query set so the one i told you which is going to be very important for this is going to be contains so i'll move to that contains contains uh, uh contains i'll move to contains okay sorry for this contains yeah okay i am having some issue okay okay now it's fine okay so basically we have contains so uh, yeah here you can see this one yes so uh, objects dot filter and this is the it this is it this contains me this uh, this keyword is being looked uh, in this headline okay so so for uh, if even uh, we'll design the same thing for the title one so let's uh, get started with this uh, so what we can do we'll move to urs.py file and then we'll define a path then search data then i'll define views dot search data okay and name is equal to search data so basically i'll define search data now what I can do, so I'll define in my views, define search data and it will take a request as a parameter and we'll do what uh, I'll try to, uh, then we'll perform the operation. So till time I can do the pass. So basically if you, if you want to do fetch the query, then I'll move to my index.html page. So this is search by title. Okay. So I'll give it to person URL okay search data okay so this would uh, perform my query to that and then uh, this is the form so here you can see so here you can see this uh, uh, I want to show you one thing okay let me do right click inspect so basically I, what I'm to, uh, to trying to show here that uh, this thing is a form okay and this whole thing uh, you can see yeah so yeah so here you can see uh, yeah uh, this is a form which is being highlighted now this to do title to do title to do description to do priority this is a form in, in itself so for that form to submit this we refer to the add button and for this form, uh, it has no button. So we will create a button for this form. Okay. So sorry, by title is a form in itself. Plus this is in a form itself in itself. Okay. So for that, what we can do, we'll move to that search by title search data and we'll create a button, button type is equal to submit. A uh, name is equal to uh, uh, for that we do a uh, button type is equal to submit and we'll do submit or search. So let me do search query. Okay, search by search. Okay, and now for that we can do a uh, class is equal to button button primary. Okay, for that we'll and style I'll define a style is equal to display block and margin zero auto okay so this would define a button to the center 
okay and let me do one ramp so it would also give a top margin here so when i'll refresh this page here you can see i have a search button fine now when uh when i move here so to search the to initially see see see, see if it's working fine uh i'll define a queue it will go to request sorry request dot get query and i'll define a http response of queue so let me move to my page i'll refresh this and i'll type cricket okay uh, uh, cr i'll type cr so yes it gives me a http response of cr so it works fine okay now we would render the uh, this to do objects uh, on our uh, 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 front end so basically uh, we can do what we can do uh, we'll okay uh, i want to show you one thing also uh, we have contains so basically this is equal to uh, even uh, last time i showed you contains this one this one this one this one okay yeah yeah i wanted to show you this thing so case sensitive containment this is contains uh, so basically there is a difference slight difference between uh, this this uh, contains and i contains so basically here i stands for insensitive so this is case sensitive and this one is case insensitive so this this one i wanted to show you and this is equal to this sql query where headline is percent this keyword so okay so basically this is uh, this is a small difference i wanted to show you between the contains and uh, uh, insensitive contains so basically there is a difference of this keyword i so we can move to our application now so what we can do so uh, i'll define my dictionary i'll define a dictionary then i will return render okay then request then list dot html okay if you want to show the uh, result in the list itself so basically we are referring to the same template again and again then context is equal to my dictionary this is pretty much same as above but here a difference will be so what we have all to do's okay for that we have to do dot objects dot filter okay then uh, what we are going to do filter and now we are going to define title so basically we will move to model.py file so this is the title word we are going to use title double underscore we will define double underscore contains is equal to q okay so i hope this should work fine so this is we are referring to title to have this okay so let me do one thing uh, i'll make a search query so if i type cr then we have cricket okay so it matched my query so let me do one day, list all to do so cricket 89 so i'll define a cricket so see this cricket 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 and then 90 so this is a different form working okay absolutely fine so so this is cricket 90 then i'll define another one cricket then 91 so when i should type cr so it should return all the crickets with 89 90 and 91 then even i do sort by priority okay 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 uh, sorry for this uh, okay we'll work on this but uh, till now we can uh, this is the uh, uh, okay, i'll clear this so basically this was sort uh, data so it referred to all to do's so it has no filter yet okay but when we just search data so i'll do do this again uh i'll define cricket and now i have 89 19 91 okay uh so we will next time we will try for the update operation 
so hey, okay we will check another another one then let me take uh, uh, type uh, b a so basketball would be so this is basketball okay and this is b a refers to hair as well so it is uh, referring to the b a in the basketball and football okay b a so we will define let me do another okay you can uh, type the query here as well f o o football so this would return me football only and let me type o r so this would match this regex survey order by order by so this works absolutely fine so uh, we can do for another as well let me do dj so it would return me django and py this would return me python so absolutely working fine okay so thank you guys thank you so much i'll catch up in the next tutorial so in next one we are going to do the update operation